the university, the team that run the course, um, are so welcoming and, and so supportive. It's good to have the training, it's good to have the support of the university to give us um, the skills for us to work with the students and deliver the best. What I get out of it is a feeling of being useful, not being on the scrap heap. I think dignity and respect for users and carers above all. Just remember they are people who are struggling with their own lives. The support is great. You've always got an academic staff member there to support you and you've got that peer support that you get from your colleagues in the service user and carer group. My role has been to involve users and carers for about the last five years to coordinate the programme advisory group. We started to get them to look at our module guides. Now we always put in our module guides how we are going to incorporate service user learning in our modules. I've been sorting out the database and I do the website and I also write the newsletter as well. The career that you're about to embark upon is human based. It's about people's lives and so having them involved from the beginning is just a great foundation to then build upon. It really does uh, show the impact that our role can have both good and bad. The big thing for me was about how important it is to make a really good first impression. Having somebody there who's been in quite a dramatic situation and to be able to see them as a person and see what's happened to their life now, it really helps us to understand. Oh.